One day away from the start of the college basketball season, I'm Bobby Broyles along with Rob Washburn. Today we conclude CA Hoops weekly season preview with William & Mary. Third straight 20 win season for the Tribe and once again look to have a strong core of returners to lead the way this year. Yeah, 1951 was the last time that William & Mary wow. posted three straight 20 win seasons, so that speaks volumes to the type of consistently strong program that Tony Shaver has built. A fourth one could be on the way as the Tribe welcomes back three starters who combined to average 40 points per game and several top reserves who should be ready to assume more prominent roles. William & Mary will certainly miss the leadership and rebounding of Terry Tarpey and Sean Sheldon, but the Tribe has the talent to contend for CAA championship and NCAA tournament berth once again. We caught up with head coach Tony Shaver at Media Day to discuss his team's expectations heading into the upcoming season. Well, to win a CAA championship. Uh, to, uh, you know, we, we have high expectations, there's no question about that, and uh, I think from a coaching perspective, one of the things that's always a goal of mine or an expectation of mine is that, uh, is that we play really well together. I mean, I think for us to be a great team, we have to share the ball, we have to be a great team and not a group of individuals, so that certainly be, will be a goal. Like we mentioned, Rob, William & Mary does return several key starters, in particular senior Omar Pruitt. Yeah, it's been fun to watch the steady progression of Omar Pruitt from CA Rookie of the Year to All-CA Third Team as a sophomore to All-CA First Team last year when he poured in 18 points per game on 49% shooting. He's now the leader of the group and will be counted on in a variety of ways. Senior guard Daniel Dixon added 12.5 points per game and hit a team-high 73s last season despite dealing with a wrist injury. Back to run the show is energetic point guard David Cohn, who averaged over 12 points per game in CAA play and ranked second in the league in assists. Junior wing Greg Malinowski and sharpshooter Connor Birchfield got plenty of quality minutes last year and are ready to move into starting spots. The key for the Tribe will be getting production in the post from attorneys Jack Whitman, Hunter Seacat, and Paul Rowley, along with freshman Nathan Knight. Coach Shaver again at Media Day talking about his senior Omar Pruitt. Well, grown is a good word. I mean, he's grown in every way in each of his years at William and Mary, uh, not just physically, uh, but uh, you know, as a person, he's grown. His maturity level's grown. Uh, he's gotten better as a player, and I think the the biggest step we want him to make this year is to become more of a complete player, uh, across the board, really excel in what he's trying to do. Uh, but but now as a senior, leadership will be expected of him and. Uh, you know, last year we had Terry Tarpey and Sean Sheldon as leaders, but he's one of those seniors that we expect great uh, leadership from, and uh, so we'll expect that type of growth from him. William & Mary will open up their season with a home game versus Bridgewater this Saturday, November the 12th at 2 o'clock. At Media Day, we got to catch up with William & Mary's Daniel Dixon to talk about his game day experience. You can check Daniel's game day experience along with all of our other student-athlete features and team previews now on casports.com and our social media platforms. That is it from us here at CA Hoops Weekly. Excited for the action to tip off tomorrow. Be sure to stay with casports.com for all the latest in men's basketball. Enjoy the start of the season, everyone.